Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars. And you're not going to believe what Katie Cork, I call her Katie Cork, did on um, her uh, new show. He's making makers of new Katie Cork documentary and gun violence deceptively edited in an interview between Cork and a group of gun rights activists in an apparent attempt to embarrass the activists. An audio recording in the full interview shows. At 21.48, Mark of Under the Gun, a scene of Katie Cork investigating, interviewing members of Virginia Citizens Defense League, a gun rights organization, is shown. Cork can be heard in the interview asking the activists from the group if there are no background Checks for gun purchasers. How do you prevent felons or terrorists from purchasing gun? Documentary then shows activists sitting silently for nine awkward sentence, seconds, unable to provide an answer. Then cuts to the next scene. And uh, there's a video. The raw audio between Katie Kirk and activists provide something else, however. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and play this. It's only 20 seconds. I uh, hope the microphone picks it up. I'll move it close to the speaker. Okay, you heard it. Uh, this dishonest piece of human garbage. How dare she even call herself a journalist? Uh, my God, she altered. She claimed she made the claim de facto that uh, they didn't have an answer for this. In fact, they answered immediately, and they came up with a bunch of different things. Point here is that Kitty Cork is dishonest. How dare she? She does not even deserve to call herself a journalist doing this type of thing. She ought to lose her job immediately for this. Under the Gun builds itself as a documentary that examines events and people who have kept the gun debate, debate peer, fierce and the progress slow, even as gun deaths and mass shootings continue to increase. It follows a number of gun violence victims and those who have lost family members due to gun violence as they advocate for stricter gun control laws. The one hour and 45 minute film was executive produced and narrated by Katie Carrick. So there you have it, this dishonest witch. Uh, I, I'm i furious, I'll tell you that much. Under the Gun has been labeled dishonest, politicking in the guise of media coverage, loose with the facts and the full-length assault on guns and the Second Amendment by those in the gun community since its debut in May 15th. The Virginia Citizens Defense League labeled the deceptively edited segment featuring, featured in the film unbelievable and extremely unprofessional. I'd say that's being rather kind. Philip Van Cleve, the organization's president, said that editing was done deliberately making it appear that league members didn't have a response for credit. Cork's question. Katie Cork asked a key question during an interview of some members of our organization, he said. She then intentionally removed their answers and spliced in nine seconds of some prior video of our members sitting quietly and not responding. Viewers are left with the misunderstanding that the members had no answer to her question. 
Nora Ryan, the chief of staff for Epix, a cable channel that is airing documentary, Monterey told Free Bacon in an email under the guns, a critically acclaimed documentary that looks at the polarizing and politicized issue of gun violence, a subject that elicits strong reactions from people on both sides, and lying by Katie Couric. Epic stands behind Candy Cork, who is a liar, 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 pants on fire, liar, liar, pants on fire, liar, liar, pants on fire. Director Stephanie Sotig, and this, that's not going to happen, in their creative and editorial judgment, we, reckon, we encourage people to watch the film and decide for themselves. Like hell. So, uh, this is what passes for journalistic integrity nowadays. Katie Cork uh, should be fired immediately. She does not even deserve to draw a paycheck. I don't know, I guess the CBS cuts her paycheck. Katie Cork, I'm direct, directly addressing you. You do not even deserve to draw a paycheck. After this episode, you should be banned permanently from journalism. Period then the subject. Ban, 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 ban. Ban her, ban her, ban her, ban her, ban her, ban her. This is disgusting and abhorred. You're not infuriated infuriated by this and I can't help you. This is disgusting. It's abhorred. If you're not infuriated, I don't know why. I'm on a fact to Mars right now. I am hot. The site is Washington Free Beacon. I'll try to uh, put that link on this video so you can go to it and see for yourself. This is disgusting. I'm on a fact to Mars. Thanks for watching. Terrorists. Sirs.